Hi all, my name is Anil Nair and I strongly believe that in competitive examination, it is not about your mathematical and your verbal skills that will be tested. Any student who is good in reading and reasoning skills will have an edge over the student who is just good in reproducing the formulas and getting the answers. In this video, I am going to help students to solve aptitude problems through a cube they have never seen before. And I will try to take some past competitive examination original questions and I will try to solve them with absolutely no usage of X and Y and that too in less than 45 seconds. I hope you will enjoy this video. Let us start with a question. Let us discuss a question from permutation and combinations. How many five digit numbers that can be formed by using the digits 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, repetition not allowed, are perfect squares. And I have seen a lot of students keeping unit digit as 1 and 4 and trying out the enumeration. Kindly do not solve it. Listen to my approach. Solution. Every perfect square will have digital sum 1, 4, 7 or 9. If the number is a perfect square, it will definitely have digital sum 1, 4, 7 or 9. All the numbers with the digital sum 1, 4, 7 or 9 may or may not be perfect squares. There are 5 digits and there are 5 places. These 5 digits can come in any of the 5 places in 5 factorial ways. 120. Observe 1 out of that 120 numbers. What will be 1 number? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. What is the sum of the digits? 15. What is 15 digital sum? 1 plus 5? 6. If you change the order of the digits, will the digital sum will change? No. That means all the 120 numbers are having a digital sum 6. If it has got 1, 4, 7 or 9, then it is a perfect square. Because it got digital sum 6, it is not a perfect square. This is how you should solve some of the P and C questions. For example, how many 5 digit numbers with a digital sum 3? are perfect squares. No. If it is a perfect square, it should have digital sum 1, 4, 7 or 9. Again, for this question, answer will be 0. I hope you enjoyed this logic. Keep watching Anil Nair Classes YouTube channel. Make handwritten notes. One of the oldest yet powerful effective technique to go through all the key concepts present in a chapter before the examination.